So there's a Florida police chief who was fired over minority first practices in hiring, meaning he was hiring people of color first. Uh, we got a clip. Let's take a look at the clip. I made the decision that it was in the best interest of the department to separate with the current uh, chief of police. Fort Lauderdale City Manager Chris Lagerblum announcing his decision to fire Police Chief Larry Scarato after just six months on the job. The allegation is discrimination in promoting officers. Scarato is firing back. The EEOC report is a report built on hearsay. There is no testimony. There is no transcript. There's no audio. An investigation alleged that Scarato made promotions based on race, gender, and sexual orientation. The report says at one point, Scarato was pointing to a wall of pictures of command staff saying, that wall is too white, I'm going to change that. The bottom row had several white males and one white female, and we were talking in conversation as it relates to our community and the expectation of that diverse and inclusive organization. And how do I purport that we have that if the entire bottom row are white men? Diversity in any department is um, a plus, and we strive to be diverse in our organization. We strive to represent the community that we serve. There's just certain lawful ways to uh, allow that <laughs> diversity to happen, and in this case, the investigative report indicated we didn't quite follow the law. <laughs> mm. James, what, what is your what is your initial reaction here, man? You know, I heard you say my dog. First of all, it's it's Fort Lauderdale, and I'm just like, damn. And then when I tell you that they scared, but this man is looking for the people, are is hiring people that's in that community, and that's right. right. The LGBT com uh, community is really big down there. <laughs> okay, right. the black community is really huge down there. People of color are really huge down there. So, so when he said he looked at that wall, that wall too white. Goddamn right, it's too white. Change all of that. Right. Get the people right. from the community that that needs to be in there and that knows how to work their community. That's what we need. Hmm. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Mess that on that cap. Because let's be real. I must say that's that on that and then go on to my own diatribe. <laughs> <laughs> I hate me. Um, these cats don't even live in the cities that they police. Hmm. They come from the suburbs. They come from Perrine. Well, they may not drive that far, but they come from Miramar, right? They out there in the nicest of neighborhoods and they come into the city of Fort Lauderdale and they take taxpayer dollars beat up our citizens because we know what y'all doing come on from pump now now one place i know and i can call home is for a lot of and i know that place right a little too well right we know right. what y'all doing <laughs> y'all taking all the money out of there all these police officers don't look like nobody in in in, in, in for lauderdale you're right uh james for lauderdale is diverse diverse mm -hmm. Go, go in the neighborhood in Fort Lauderdale and show me that's predominantly white in the city of Fort Lauderdale proper. Show it to me. I mean, maybe maybe down in Las Olas area, if you're going to include that, I don't know. Maybe you find some folks and that's the, you know, the LGBTQIA community down there. So it's got a reason to be diverse. Right. But here's the game. The game is now, oh, you want to give us diversity. If you give us diversity, then that means you're a racist and now we can fire you. So he did he did the right thing. He just did it a little too early. He didn't have he didn't there, there wasn't the, the proper chain of command in place for him to make that. You know, what I mean, to try to make yeah. that change. Mm. Um, so he came to expand in, on that a little amazing. bit. More. <laughs> just just like I mean, it, it goes to um, just changing everything from the local level. But in order to make those changes, you got it. You got to have the support of your your mayor and your your and what's up from that and then your governor and the city council and stuff like that so so he was it, it was it was right place wrong time if 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 you put it that way um okay you know yeah so I, you know what i can't disagree with you because of what he was only there for what six months god they got rid of that boy so quick god damn. <laughs> he came in he was like oh no he changed it too much no nah, man oh he Get actually gone. mean diversity <laughs> <laughs> He right, came he in like, and oh, meant really, diversity really and inclusion. And he, pro he probably uh, ran on that because don't, don't you have to be elected to be the police chief? Isn't, isn't the police chief elected or are they, are they appointed? No, not, not in the city structure. The sheriff there is is, okay. is elected, uh, but uh, okay. in the city structure, that's usually a hired position. Okay, right, and then and then if it's a city manager, a strong you know, if it's a weak mayor, strong city manager, like we just saw, he's able to pull the trigger on a 
firing. Uh, so that tells me the city manager down there got a little bit too much power. Maybe oh, that, so he, that's my estimation. So he he pulled he pulled the, he pulled the, uh, the classic classic interview move. He went in there and he he you know he did the song and dance in his interview. In the back of his mind, he was like, "Oh, I'm about to shake it up when I get in here." He just he just uh, <laughs> spoke a little out of turn. A little, little too Sorry soon. to that man. <laughs> he shook the table a whole lot. <laughs> oh, you shaking it. Now the listen, table. listen, we we we're laughing, but we really st- we do stand in solidarity with you, brother. But we're gonna giggle yeah. a little bit because you really thought you were gonna be able to pull this off and that racist ass style. <laughs> we appreciate you. <laughs> no, 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 because that's but that's that, like we, we were talking about Brian Flores. Like it takes courage. Somebody yeah. gotta be the first out the gate. Like, shout out to that man for taking it on the chin. Yep. The next person understand you gotta change the city manager first. So let's 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 work on that. Let's get rid of that city manager. I just be throwing around stuff. <laughs> yeah, and speaking <laughs> threatening people's that, jobs man. and stuff. Speaking of Brian, <laughs> like Florida, I got power, Doctor Matt. I'm coming for you next week, buddy. <laughs> Wait a minute, man. You can't threaten Doctor Matt while he ain't here. I know. I I know. I'm gonna send him a text too when we're done. Just to let him. Know. <laughs> So I'm, I'm assuming Dwayne. I'm, I'm assuming that your microphone has been on to the audience yes. all this time, right? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, all right. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, man. For this, so Brian Flores. Uh, no, no, what's it. going on with Brian Flores? I'm save it. I'm gonna save it because there ain't nothing going on with Brian Flores. That's why I'm gonna save it to, so so me mm. and Mac can have that conversation again. Because I do remember. <laughs> I think all of us remember <laughs> how passionately our brother, Doctor Mac. This is so unfair. We should not be roasting him in his absence. Ex- you, exactly, he's not here. Look, he can't defend himself. <laughs> Somebody cut this segment. Send it to Doctor Mac because we 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 gonna say it. We gonna say it again when he's back. <laughs> but ain't nobody even talking about Brian Flores right now, man. Mm, I wonder mm. why he mm. went got him a job, and now. Mm. What do we? Mm. What, 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 what? They they swept that under the rug. They probably gave. Well, maybe it, you, know, you know what? We gonna wait till Doctor Matt come in. I think we should yeah. wait. Yeah, our, no, we gotta. Mm, yeah, because I because I don't want to answer to him off air. So y'all wait till that man come on in. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ain't gonna set me up, get my head knocked off. <laughs> All right. Uh, mm. uh, 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 ben, ben. I understand uh. power levels here. I understand appropriate power levels as, as, as such. Uh, anyway, I think also, though, <laughs> we got to remember that this brother in uh, Fort Lauderdale, while we are kind of giggling on his behalf, um, in a similar way, he, he jumped out there to actually mean what he said when he said diversity and inclusion. Yeah. Right? Dwayne, I agree with you. Maybe it was a little too soon, but he did it and he took it on the chin. So, you know, we'll stay in a solidarity with him for sure. Ain't no question. Like, where the rally at? Where the rally at? Where, where, what's the plan? What's the move? Because they're playing a game with him. They fired him because he actually tried to bring in diversity. And they did it with hearsay. Like, no actual real evidence. Like, that shows you how how pathetic they are but how malicious they are they will fire you with no real evidence if you actually try to bring in diversity so we're 100 gonna stand with that brother in fort lauderdale 